So how many people served on the jury back in the day? Nine. Nine. Wow. Terry. Oh! oh. Hi. I heard that. Who am I talking to? Give me your name. That's pretty cool. It was. <laughs> And the courthouse was downstairs. Wow. Hello? What was that? I don't know. Somebody coming up the steps? Hello? I don't see anybody. Well, that was pretty cool. Shouldn't be like... Okay, let's see. Who is that? Is that Terry? It's gone. Whatever it is. Jury form. Are y'all working on the case right now? Because I'm a lawyer and I want to give you instructions. Same by one second. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I just caught the figure at the same time. Okay. It disappeared immediately. So, Mr. Foreman, are you still here? I didn't get to have my discussion with you. Did you ever have prisoners try to come up here and get to you? How about obnoxious lawyers that come to keep arguing? That one is really easy. So if you, you know, see, it's easy. It doesn't hurt you at all. So is that a yes on the obnoxious lawyers that want to keep on arguing? Periscope. Can you come another one? Come on. Another one. Another one. Okay, two more. Very good. See, that didn't hurt you at all. I'm going to take that as the obnoxious lawyers. But he's got a hand out. Keep going forward. I can't. Okay, then. All right, down. Can you reach, touch her hand? So you can shake her hand. There you go. He's close to it. My hand is tingling. He's there. He's close to it. There he goes. He's touching it. How are you doing? Are you the foreman? Yep. yep. Sir, this is Mike. And Mike is new. And I'm wondering if you might try to shake Mike's hand. Still there? Yep, he's still there. Go slow. To the right, Mike. To the right. Forward. To the right. Towards the chair. Wait a minute. Just slow down. Slow down. Turn your body the other way. Down. Can you shake Mike's hand forward a little bit? I can tell where Mike's hand is. Move back over this way towards the rail. Yeah. A little more Mike to the rail. And down. There you go. Shake Mike's hand. There he goes. He's shaking your hand, Mike. Right across from the nursery. Did you take care of the children? Care of Periscope. Yes. <clears throat> Thank you.
Thank you. Yes, that's good. That's great. Um, I'm sure it was a big job taking care of children. I don't know how you did it. Wouldn't be my kind of thing. Kids are okay when they're somebody else's. Bessie, do you play with the other children around here? Do you chase the cat? I heard there's a cat that runs around here. You run around and try to catch him by the tail? Oh, oh Periscope. There you go. Keep going. Next one up. Okay. There's a couple more. You can do it. That's good. Three more. Very good. Thank you. And I do the crabbing. And so much. She likes it so much. I had to buy her a boat. And then we fixed the boat. But I'm sure she'll take you with her when she goes fishing, if you'd ask. Just don't hurt her over there. Questions? Do you like shrimping, Mr. Henry? Do you eat your shrimp with the heads on or do you cut them off? I like cocktail sauce. But there's all kinds of things you can do with shrimp. We made shrimp tacos the other night. Do you know what a taco is? No? It's kind of like this flat bread. And it's Mexican. It's a flat bread, like a corn tortilla. And you put the shrimp in the middle and fold it up and eat it. It's good. Do you like your shrimp with hush puppies? How about mashed potatoes? I love to cook. Would you like to cook? She's a little bit of a lightweight. Don't smash your nose into the thing. Anytime, anytime you want to back out, so it's fine. I'm good at this point. Green. You want to give it a try? Mr. Henry, this is Carol. She's new to this whole thing. So be gentle with her. Just relax. So you didn't answer me about crabbing. You like to crab? You like Miss Carol? Wow. See, back of her shirt says ghost bait, but she's fearless. She's here. Because she's really interested and wants to know what's going on. She just had a birthday. Can you tell her happy birthday? <laughs> Did you ever make any uh, moonshine while you were here? Yeah. Well, 
Do you drink any moonshine? Okay, Mikey. I'm sucking air in through the breath. Okay, relax. Close your eyes. Dangle your arms. Don't tense up. Relax. Relax. This is Mike. And Mike would like to know that you're here. Can you put your hand on Mikey's back? Yeah, he's a big boy. You'd have to really push him. Have you seen anything? Uh, <coughs> Periscope went on. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so, do you like Mikey? I can know. Is this Mr. Henry? Sure. Hey Henry, this is Joe. Do you remember me still? If, it's, if you're still here, can you push on uh, Mike's back for me, please? So we're wondering if somebody wants to have a conversation with us. So if you do, if you could light up any one of these things, use any of them at all. So we heard that this was called the hanging tree. Is that what you called it? Were you hung here at one point? No, wow. Huh? I said you just jump right to it. Yeah, just jump right to it. <clears throat> if you were, we'd like to hear your story. If you could just tell us that you're here. Front. Front. In the front of the tree? Right. We're all in the front of the tree. Are you here in the front of the tree with us? If you're in the front of the tree, if you could light up any one of these things, that'd be great. Because we don't know exactly where you are. We can't see you. Do you consider this the front of the tree? Okay, two. Three. Okay, see, that didn't hurt you. That's cool. <clears throat> yeah, if y'all see anything going off, just yell it out, point at it, even if you don't know. This is it, perfect. So, can you tell me your name? England, it says. Okay. Were you from England? Did you get caught doing something that you weren't supposed to be doing? Are there any women that have been hung out here? Yes. Yes. Okay. Are you one? Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> Are you, Are you a, a Native American? Burn some English settlers. Yes. yes. 